But first, the school board president calling for an investigation into school trustee travel policy. It comes as the president herself has some questionable expenditures and took a trip to Disney World when she should have been at an anti-bullying conference on the taxpayer's dime. Well, as Contact 13 investigative reporter Joe Bartels tells us, taxpayers paid 2000 bucks for her to attend the conference. President Deanna Wright has a lot of responsibility at the nation's fifth largest school district. Trips out of town, not that unusual, but newly obtained documents show the president left a conference early and ended up at the happiest place on earth. I'm asking for an investigation because nobody should pay for her to use our money to go to a conference to go to Disneyland. School board president Deanna Wright could only look on at a marathon school board meeting, then confronted head on for a trip that's now getting attention. All regulations, rules, policies, guidelines are being followed and to please um, Report back to us. President Wright calling on new superintendent Jesus Jara to investigate all of the trustees for travel expenses. Contact 13 obtained this letter from Wright asking for a thorough review. It comes as Contact 13 sources have revealed travel records for the president's trip, a national conference on bullying in March 2017, and it may have included a jaunt to Disney World. The final day of the conference was supposed to wrap up with a keynote session and a closing speaker around 11 a.m. But according to receipts submitted by President Wright, on Friday, March 3rd, while the conference was still going on, President Wright summoned an Uber around 9.53 a.m. The destination, 1317 C's Drive, also listed as the parking lot for Disney World in Orlando. Nearly 12 hours later, Wright requested another Uber from Disney World and returned to her taxpayer expensed hotel room for the night. We work hard for our money and we work hard to, you know, make our kids better, which every parent should fe feel angry or upset because who wouldn't? It's like she's taking our money out of our pockets. Parents and critics say the jaunt is questionable at best. Online records show there were at least two flights Wright could have booked after the conference and possibly saved taxpayers money. We went to Wright's Henderson home not once, but three times looking for her side of things. Contact 13 saw someone peek through the blinds, but no one came to the door. We have tried every avenue to get a hold of Trusty Wright today, but our request for comment was not returned. A school district source says trustees are allowed to arrive a day before and leave a day after, and their meals reimbursed at 75%. Joe Bartels, 13 Action News. Joe, thank you.